Pensbury. I'm Ava Holmes. And I'm Elise Carey with your daily announcements. Today is Monday, February 28th, Day 108, Rotation Day 2. Attention juniors, on March 3rd at 7 p.m., join Brooke Stout, post-secondary counselor, to discuss the post-secondary planning process. Mrs. Stout will give a short presentation, followed by time for questions. If you have a question you would like to submit in advance, you can do so here. Please access the event from a Pensbury account at Google Meet. The link is posted in the student bulletin. If you are attending the junior prom and plan on leaving early, please complete the form located in the student bulletin. On March 2nd, from 2.20 to 3.30, the FCCLA is holding a special prom attire event for all Pensbury students. And the best part is, everything is free. Come to Falcon Cafeteria at West for the best selection of prom, formal, dances, or any school-related occasions. The German club is selling its super fun like fun hoodie. Sweatshirts are hooded in black with this logo front and center. Order forms can be found by clicking on the QR code here. Or students can see Frau DeFazio in room C115 for more information. Danke sehr. Don't forget to sign up for after school SAT prep classes in preparation for the March 12th SAT. You can access the registration form on the counseling page of the high school's website. Click on SAT prep courses. The English section starts today and the math section starts March 7th. Please email Mrs. Malinowski with any questions. We are hashtag Friesen for a reason. Pensbury students and staff, we need your help to spread inclusion. Do you want to pledge to show your commitment to inclusion? Do you want to see you, your friends and administrators get soaked wet by a fire hose? On Friday, March 18th, we will be having a polar spray right here outside at PHS. For only $5, you can take part in this unique and fun event. Just hit the QR code to make your donation. Act now. <laughs> Today is the last day of Black History Month. Here is a profile of a significant group in our history who answered the call when democracy was in danger. Hello, this is Brady Bergfechtel with a Black History Month profile of the day. The Tuskegee Airmen were young African Americans who aspired to become pilots but were met with significant obstacles starting with the widespread belief that African Americans could not learn to fly or operate sophisticated aircrafts. Through all the struggle, in 1941, there were 13 members of the first class of aviation cadets. By the time they flew their last combat mission on April 26, 1945, they had destroyed or damaged 36 German planes in the air, 237 on the ground, and as nearly as 1,000 rail cars and transport vehicles, and even a German destroyer. After their brave sacrifice, the Tuskegee Airmen returned home to a country where they continued to face many racial obstacles in their home country. These men represent an important step forward in preparing the nation for the racial integration of the military and desegregating the U.S. Armed Forces and mandating equality of opportunity. A number of the original Tuskegee Airmen would then go on to longer careers in the military, with some becoming the first African American leaders in our military. This has been your Black History Month profile of the day. Now back to the announcements. And now here's Breezy Brady with this week's Falcon Forecast. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, Pensbury. I'm Breezy Brady, and I'm back doing the Falcon Forecast. I'm really hoping for some warm weather because I'm starting to get bored of this winter stuff. But anyways, here's the weather for this week. Today, it's going to be sunny all day with a high of 39 and low of 24, but it's going to be a bit breezy out there today. And Tuesday, it will be mostly cloudy with a high of 53 and low of 35. Wednesday, it will be partly cloudy with a high of 56 and low of 42. So get outside, maybe go to the LMT, a park, or maybe get around to golfing. I don't know. And then Thursday, it will be partly cloudy with a high of 45 and low of 20, so it's going to be a bit chilly out there. And then for Falcon Friday, the day will consist of clouds and a high of 42 and low of 29. And I think next week it's getting a little warmer. Maybe the groundhog was right after all. I really don't know. I hope so. But I hope spring will come sooner. But this is it for this week's Falcon Forecast. I'm Breezy Brady, now back to the announcements. In sports, now an announcement from our tennis team. Boys tennis tryouts will start on March 7th from 2.45 to 4.30 p.m. Bring your running sneakers. Thank you, Coach Twyman. 
Attention softball players, grades 9 through 12. Tryouts begin March 7th at PHS East. Weather will determine the times and location. Information will be posted on a remind on Sunday, March 6th. Thank you, Coach McSherry. Attention 9th through 12th grade girls interested in trying out for lacrosse this spring. Tryouts will be held the week of March 7th, time to be determined based on weather. You will need a completed physical and family ID to try out. Please look for information on Remind or email Coach McPherson for any questions. There are so many amazing accomplishments in Falcon Sports this past week. Tomorrow, Pensbury Channel's Rowan McCollin will break it down in her new announcement feature, Just Sports. Tune in tomorrow. That's it for our daily announcements. I'm Elise Carey. And I'm Ava Holmes. Have a great week, Pensbury. And, and don't, don't forget, forget to keep, keep the peace. peace.